Okay, so we're gonna put down the pick and try some stuff with our right hand fingers. Let's try how about a, just a D minor chord over there. And then we're gonna do thumb on the fourth string. Thumb, index, middle, ring, middle, index. And then thumb's gonna alternate over to the fifth string. So I got fourth string thumb, fifth string thumb, fourth string thumb, fifth string thumb. And, and keep in mind that all the motion is with your hand here is just closing your finger, fingers towards your palm or the thumb goes like that. You know, there's not any like wrist or arm going on with that. It's just, uh, you know, just, just fingers. And then why not put that together with A7? Those fit together really good in music. Same thing, I'm gonna alternate between the A string and the low E over here, so I got it. All together, here's D minor. completely different. Here's the part of that Gautier song. It's just the fifth fret here. That's a D. And this little shape makes it minor at the seventh and sixth frets down here on the second and third strings. So we slide it down to the third fret. These two are going to be the same fret at the fifth fret and that's going to be a major. So maybe first just getting a D minor and then C major. D minor, C major. Now our thumb is going to play this bass line down here. Here we got this chord. All together is going to sound like and the rhythm for each one of those is just uh, one, two, and. So we're going to go one, two, and. And then same thing for this one. Three, four, and one. starts to sound like we're playing a kind of a bass line and a chord thing at the same time and that's the possibilities that you can get into when you start you know using different fingers over here in the right hand cool have fun with that see ya